Hi, welcome to Tech Report from the Center for the Ministry of Teaching at Virginia Theological Seminary. I'm Kyle Oliver, and today I'm going to tell you about a great user-friendly design tool called Canva. Anyone working in a church today needs to be able to create attractive visuals for promoting events, for reaching out to people online, and for doing all of those other bits of work that we do in the church that uh, require an image rather than simply text. If you're like me, you might not be very good at doing that on your own or using complicated uh, tools like Adobe Photoshop. And uh, so Canva is a great alternative and I wanna show you a little bit about how it works. We're in the main menu here and you can see that Canva has a number of built-in uh, design dimensions already for you to go. So let's say we want to create a cover image for a, uh, for a, a church's Facebook page. It already knows the dimensions that that should be and it's gonna make some recommendations of some uh, graphic elements that you might use in incorporating that. I really appreciate that feature of Canva because I am not particularly visually creative and so I need a little inspiration. Here's some uh, promotional materials we created for the center that were inspired by this uh, pre-made design that uh, was already, uh, was already uh, built by uh, the fine graphics folks at Canva. Um, Another thing that this tool is tailor-made for is helping you uh, create very quickly these inspirational quotes with images, sometimes called memes, that uh, lots of churches are sharing to great effect. This one about a quote from Pope Francis did uh, really, really well for us here in the center. To create something like this, uh, you can basically scroll through a bunch of pre-made designs. I, uh, I liked this image of light here, and so I might take an appropriate quote from the Bible and paste it in. And uh, you can see that very quickly a, uh, a set of uh, words and images uh, come together that, uh, that, will, that will work well. Uh, this would have taken me a pretty long time to put together in PowerPoint and uh, using Canva, it's, uh, it's incredibly easy. Another great feature of this tool is that for only a dollar an image, uh, you have access to a great stock uh, photo uh, library. I searched for light earlier and uh, found that this was a uh, really attractive photo that if I wanted to go with a different uh, sort of metaphor uh, for this quote, I could use uh, something like this. So again, it just gets you up and running really quickly. What I've been particularly impressed with lately are these tutorials that Canva's been creating. Uh, this is one I did recently, how to pick colors that look great together. And so you basically, using the Canva interface, get to step through and uh, do various exercise, exercises. So here I change the colors on this, uh, on this watermelon. Uh, here I'm encouraged to choose a bright color that will pop out against this background. And uh, so I can uh, go through the uh, color tool here and as they're suggesting, pick, it, pick something that is bright and will, uh, will show up well. Uh, I completed this tutorial and by the end of it felt like I really had a much better grasp on how to create attractive images. You can also check out the Canva blog for the latest and greatest about their uh, various tools. Uh, this uh, recent post is about flat design, so if your new iPhone uh, graphic scheme looks different to you, uh, you might want to uh, check out what that's all about and learn how to uh, create uh, imagery that takes advantage of, of that trend. So anyway, Canva is a great tool and it recently came out of closed beta, which means you no longer need an invitation to set up an account. So I strongly encourage you to check it out and I hope that it uh, greatly empowers your ministry of communication visually online.